Hi, I'm Christine McKay and welcome to Create and Crafts Craft Academy. Today I want to show you two different ways that you can use the double-sided tape that maybe you haven't thought about before. Typically the double-sided tape is really great for adhering photos down quick and easy. I love this tape because it's one and a half inches. So, you know what's really popular and trending right now? fabric tape. This is a perfect product to create your own fabric tape. You'll simply take a piece of uh, just leftover fabric scrap and peel off your tape and simply lie it right down on the fabric. And I'll be honest, um, I really don't uh, measure. I mean, if you wanted to save fabric, you could go all the way to the edge. Um, but I like to just make sure that I get it all the way across. So I simply run it along, snip, and then I'll take my scissors just like this. And you can kind of get the idea. Basically, I'm just uh, trimming right along the line so that you can make sure the fabric goes all the way to the edge. Um, and think about all the fun types of fabrics that you could do. You can do floral tape, you could do lace tape, canvas, burlap, all with this double-sided tape. And I think, like I said, it's the one and a half inches I, that makes it just really fun and dynamic. And you can also, because it has that second um, piece on it, it will stay put until you're ready to use it. Now, the one thing that I would say that you wanna make sure you do, and you can use um, a credit card or you can use the back of a pair of scissors, is you just wanna make sure that you um, uh, kind of brayer it um, or just really press it down to make sure that the adhesive sticks firmly, just like that. And there you go, you have your very own custom fabric tape. And what I like to do, this was the only spool I could find, but what I like to do for gifts is to actually um, use like an old wooden spool or an empty spool. But you kind of get the idea by simply wrapping it around you know, whatever length that you've done. And then I'll usually like tie it with a little piece of jute and maybe a pin to hold it in place. And you can actually give these away as gifts, um, your own homemade custom fabric tape right here. And when you get ready to use it, all you have to do is simply peel off the backing and it is ready to go. And it is a great, look at that, it's already, has that adhesive stuck right to the back. Now, tip number two for the adhesive, um, double-sided adhesive tape. Um, this one, I am going to use a little mat. And I'm just gonna do a little, a little piece right here because I think you'll kind of get the idea. So you'll just trim it. In fact, you know what? I'm gonna make a little pennant edge. So I'm just going to cut like a little V out of the end. I think I'm gonna do that to the other side too really quickly. So this is a great way that you can either do tape, you can do um, the ends of bows, simply lay it flat, just like this. Okay, and typically you would like probably like you would put that on the card first or um, uh, Right now, like if you're gonna use it right away, you can use the technique that I'm doing right now. If you wanna store it like we did the fabric tape, then do, do it that way, don't peel it off yet. Then you'll just take your glitter. Um, let's see, let's use a silver glitter. So you can kind of see on the paper, if I hold it just right, where the, oh, there we go, see where the adhesive is? Um, so obviously that is where the glitter is going to stick. And you can either use your finger or use a piece of paper and just kind of make, kind of rub that in. Just like that. And there you go. You have a perfect shape every time if you want to use that technique or if you want, like I said, if you want to use the, the glitter uh, tape, then you would just do it just like we did with the ribbon and not peel the backside off. So you think about how fun that is with the one and a half inches, you could cut out some hearts, you could cut out some letters, create your very own glitter shapes. So next time, try something creative and unique with your double-sided tape beyond just simply gluing a photo down. Thanks for joining me and don't forget, you can always come to Craft Academy for new ideas and inspiration.